All right, everyone. It is me, Johnson Chan, and uh, hope everyone uh, got a good night's sleep because I kind of did. I actually wound up having a little too much energy, so uh, woke up. Uh, actually, woke up around six, six thirty a.m. Probably like around six a.m. Then lied in my bed for apparently two and a half hours. So it's like, yeah, all right. You know, now I'm also scaling back all my video game playing. All right, so now I'm just simply playing. You know. PC stuff. I mean, I'm not. I didn't even do my Albion stuff. But that's because I'm just like the prices are going crazy. People are still playing the game like crazy. Like because of this coronavirus shit, it's been really pretty disruptive to me. At least virtual wise, right? You know, everyone else is obviously suffering. In fact, it turns out like I just saw a headline on uh, Tim Pool's videos. I don't watch his videos, but I was curious about one video where like some salon owner in like. Oregon got fined 14 grand for refusing to shut down. So it's like, yeah, it's a clear power grab by the fucking shit libs and tyrannical Democrats in charge. Um, so, but yeah, I mean, that's just what happens, right? You know, it's like, well, it's the conservatives, the Republicans are evil. Yeah, well, Democrats don't seem to be that uh, any different. So, <laughs> and to be honest, I, you know, at least when it comes to Republicans, they're too stupid to run the government properly, right? Democrats. That's actually more dangerous because they know how to run the government and they're going to run, they're definitely going to run you with the government, okay? <laughs> and not in a good way. So, but you know, <clears throat> I'm in the middle of uh, listening to the Nick Fuentes replay from last night. Everything's pretty good. Turns out, actually, he said about many, like about four dozen. So about 48 people. I'm one of them that bought the I'm with Groiper shirt in the last week. So I'm like, Got my hand rubbing and you know good to go. You know I, I, I'm checking. I'm checking my because because there's no tracking, so it's just gonna appear on my like freaking thing one day. So you know Nick always gets kind of mad when you ask him where's my merch. So it's like eh, it's like how am I gonna get my shit? <clears throat> so I'm just kind of hoping that the one time that someone decides to steal the mail, they don't steal my package because I'm basically fucked. Ah. <sighs> So anyway, uh, Bitcoin searches for last week are being finalized for 21. No data has been released for this week yet. Uh, looks like things are cooling down a little bit. Bitcoin down 67%, 24 volume 130.4 uh, billion. So it's pretty slow and modest. Bitcoin's at 96.91. I'm going to refresh this one more time just to make sure. Uh, today's a little bit of a down day because yesterday was kind of big. Uh, yeah, okay, so the prices are correct. Like coins, basically a little under $45. Uh, doggy coin is at 316.38 million. Uh, market cap, uh, hive is somewhere around here. Uh, 31.92 cents, it's going down a little bit. And of course, Steam is probably doing the same thing. Where is Steam? 21 cents. It's up 15. It's actually up 16 cents. It's actually a surprise. So I guess you never know. Like everything is just going insane right now. It's between Steam and Hive. Right, who knows what the hell is going on? All right. So looks like today's where I'll probably be down because yesterday was a pretty big day. I mean, I have no idea how, how high it went up. Yeah, you because know, obviously we did the video on early morning. So we'll see what happens. U.S. home construction drops 30%. Wow, that's a lot in April. Toy Toy grads apply for jobs that aren't the right fit. Monster account. Yeah, of course, probably because they don't have, sh like, our educational system is shit. It turns out nothing but left-wing propagandist communist types, and it's just, overall, they don't teach anything, right? That's, that's why tech companies are importing all these, you know, immigrants and shit, right? You know, like if, when I put a job offer, it's like, yeah, no, no Americans apply. <laughs> it's like, and then the, the few that do apply, they don't they're like their quality of work. You can even call it that. It's just like horrible. So, you know, so like when I go to Fiverr or whatever, it's like, yeah, you know, everyone is not American there, <laughs> essentially. So that's what happens. I mean, I mean, to be fair, you still have a couple of others, uh, Americans, like, for example, when I was looking for uh, music creation, right? But, I mean, it turns out it's just like, it's just not that good, right? The ones that were good, they demanded so much money and they wanted all the copyrights. It's like, I'm not going to agree to something like that, right? You know, meanwhile, I find a guy, uh, I think 
he has 20 plus years experience working with triple a music creation i keep all the rights i think he's i think he's somewhere in europe right usually europe is actually pretty good um i mean i can't say the reason why but i will just say it has something to do with the uh, <laughs> race and genetics right so it's like that and for some reason europe is just so much cheaper than america even though uh economy wise they're both the same so i'm not sure what's going on right uh with the price differential you know in fact uh turns out like uh i don't want to get too many personal details but someone i know right that way i'm working with uh his friend actually applied for a visa here in America, uh, him and his girlfriend. I assume they're both white Germans types, so I'm sure it'll just be just fine. Uh, and they're applying for a visa to come into America, which I just find the irony hilarious. But I mean, you know, like, I mean, I think we kind of, I mean, without risk getting bad, I think we know what kind of immigration we would want if we had to have it. So, you know. Uh, that's why I don't really have a problem with it, right? Uh, overall, you know. Aside from that, but I mean, I'm but I'm pretty sure we could control immigration to just simply restrict certain countries, anyway. So, I mean, I think we all know what I would do, right? I'll just say, oh, uh, first world countries only, and then probably we'll have to also restrict immigration from China as well, because uh, there's just kind of just like just buying up all our shit, right? Uh, which would be a problem too, because it's like, yeah, they're buying up all our shit, probably because they have money and Americans don't. So how do you square that round hole, a round stick into a square peg, or however that saying goes? So I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna walk away from a lot of this shit, but I still keep track of what's going on. So, well, my earnings boosted by online buying during crisis. Half, half expect to visit restaurants. Yeah, I mean they, like, like the globalists have done a remarkable job screwing Trump over, and really just everyone over. Like they, they did, they. They got what they wanted, you know, and it's just, uh, it's so frustrating to deal with this. Walmart, uh, Dow futures weekend, Walmart for earnings offset, U.S. China tensions. So yesterday, oh my God. So one day it's U.S. America doing great. I mean, America and China doing great. Now it's down. It's, it's like, all right. All right. So from what I can tell, um, which you acquired for $3 billion. What is Jet? I have no idea what Jet is. I never heard of Jet. It, wow. They spent three billion on Jet and got completely screwed. That's why. Well, because of Lifeline, and online sales surged seventy four percent. Yeah, of course, everyone's just buying shit online. In fact, everyone's playing video games online. All right, here, let me show you something interesting. Steam charts ESO. I believe it. Yeah, SteamCharts.com. Well, let me show you what coronavirus did. And this is common through all games, all games. All right. But this is just the most coronavirus like you know it's like yeah whatever normal 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 coronavirus hits what happens look at look at look at how many people are now fucking playing in fact i kind of like that the percent gain is going down but um you know it's getting warmer more people really want to go out uh maybe i picked a good time to just take a break from games while i wait for the overcrowding to just you know fizzle out right uh, but yesterday, last night, when I was playing, um, this number was actually pretty close to the 28,400. But look at how many people just started playing on video games all of a sudden. Like, this, like ESO literally doubled, right? What's funny is how many people will know it's because of coronavirus and not because of what they were doing themselves personally. So, uh, we'll see. But yeah, this is pretty much what happens. So... Right. Anyway, uh, GMC coins at six to eight, so nothing new here. Uh, we'll talk about the uh, swap real soon, which we already, we've already been hinting at it. 404 is at two to three, as usual. Uh, we'll be interested to see what happens with the swap info, but it doesn't matter because now we're doing the swap process. In fact, has Crex gotten back to me yet? Uh, no. In fact, when did they respond to me? 5.48 a.m. So it was actually shortly before I woke up when I wasn't supposed to. Oh, okay. So I'll probably hear from them again sometime later today or maybe tomorrow night. 2 by 2 coin doing fantastic as always. 69 to 74. So it'll be interesting to see. Compound coin, same thing. 5 grand. Up 5,000 Satoshis of a dog coin to 5,500 or 5,900. You know, same old, same old. 
All right, so I sent the email to Crex. We're doing the swap. Um, the ratio, I mean, very much just Twitter status. It's there, so just go there, right? Or it's basically 30,000 to one. Uh, because, because Crex told me they cannot use the same URL because we're keeping the same name and ticker and shit, it's going to be a two week swap period, but maybe more if Crex needs it. Because I, because I, because I don't know what other, because I sent them the details they need to start the process. I don't know what other additional instructions are needed. Uh, but they'll obviously, they'll obviously let me know because we got to send it somewhere. Uh, I just sent the email to Crex. We'll post where to, on Crex where to send. Mitch and Crex also con So Mitch is going to contact the staking pools and other non Crex exchanges, which is great because it's just a, insane for me to do this. So they can also begin swapping with Crex, hopefully as well, and they'll just simply upgrade for free. Because uh, what I don't want is they just decide to do list 404 and then just say whatever, and then I have to repay the fee, which I'm not going to do. Uh, maybe I'll repay the fee for uh, BTC pop, but that's it. You know, it's like this is just ridiculous. It's like we need to upgrade the coin. Uh, so, but uh, I don't know. I, I guess we'll just have to see what happens. Um, I mean, I, I, ho I hope it won't be a, a, a problem. Anyway, Bitcoin's impending Golden Cross may bolster bull. Okay, so we're back to... Okay, so basically another day of nothing. All right, this is just good. Uh, there's literally nothing here. All right, so hopefully... Hopefully we got something from the daily hold. Otherwise, this is going to be a really short video, right? I'm just going to be talking about the swap. Square's cash app launches automatic Bitcoin per... Okay. Uh, JPM moves. Okay, venture capitalist. Using the investment rule says it's going to compare sales, but it's only become a viable currency. Um, yeah, I mean it's like, I mean Ripple is just going to be used for like business to business stuff, like for everyday use. We won't be using it. Chainlink partners are creating technology to boost blockchain crypto. Eh, whatever, I don't care. Bitcoin, I mean, yeah, I mean, it's okay for fundamentals, right? Just more adoption, blah, blah, blah. Crypto, bit makes me as fresh. Okay, so basically it's just, a, all right, so there's just nothing of interest. Uh, Trump's chances have gone up a penny. That's good. Um, what well, is self exp Okay, I'm not reading that. Chances, morning. I'm not even going to read Twitter because I know no one's going to read it. Uh, well, obviously, people are pretty pissed at the Who, so good enough for me. Fox is on there saying we missed a great Roger Ailes. You have more anti Trumpian by far than ever before looking for a new outlet. What other part of your colleague, Team Kavu? Apparently, never read the French study or DDD. That's actually true. Um, and as Nick Fuentes has actually even called out just now from last night, yeah, Fox News is kind of on board with the uh, Globo. Uh, I want to say I want to say Globo H word, uh, globalist uh, bullshit agenda. So it's like yeah, yeah. In fact, they're actually on board with the mass hysteria uh, cr uh, crap too. So their hefty modern warfare patches players stressed out. Yes, I, I haven't even bothered with modern warfare. Um, yeah, I won't. I if Laura Ingram is really saying take it, that's really insane. Um, I'm hoping she's saying through a doctor and stuff. I can't keep your A VA out. study showed that. Okay. Uh, sheer superior what Kabuto said. My, oh, yeah. So, this was, so Bill Mitchell has always been like this huge pro Trump guy, and he's finally got his you know day in the sunlight finally, because now Trump's retweeting him. What's funny is a very lot of people still don't want to retweet him. Uh, clearly, they uh, will kill you. Uh, no, sorry. What do you feel? Okay. I will have to admit, uh, yeah. Uh, Sienna, Cage, why? What an asshole. Uh, I mean, this is. God, I don't like this guy either, but oh, all right, fine, whatever. Else. Right. Uh, okay, so he's going to do, um, yeah, just normal re election stuff. That's fine. All right, so anything about the shutdown? Uh, well, are you opening tomorrow, which would be today? Yeah, and I already looked at the stuff here. All right, so all right, so this was actually another non-news day, right? I mean, shit's just going down because yeah, I guess it's just normal people panicking, right? Maybe a little adjustments here and there, but nothing, nothing of no, nothing too crazy. 
All right, so four four coin swap. I mean, there's really not much to say, right? I just emailed them. Everything is here. You have you already have the Bitcoin talk in a detail. So it's pretty much what we already said. Swap ratio is thirty thousand to one. Uh, Crex is going to. Um, I guess they wow they haven't, they haven't even gotten around to this yet. Yeah, Crex I think is just catching up on everything. It's like I think they just took yesterday off or something. So anyway, they'll get back to me. The instructions will come soon. Uh, I assume it'll be on Discord. Or I assume he'll tweet it out here. And of course, I'll update it here. I'll write it right here up on top. So this is where you want to look at. And then we'll just do the swap. We'll, I had no idea. I've never done this before. So, But apparently, it's very easy and painless. So that's why you know Crux is doing it. Right? And I have to pay them the... Uh, I don't know if they want me to be telling people the fee. But I mean, it was... It was a reasonable fee, but it is still a chunk of change. All right, I'll leave it at that. It was still a chunk of change, but very reasonable. So money's already, I'm just waiting for them to send me the invoice so I can initiate the uh, swap process. Uh, so I don't know. Um, yeah, I guess, I guess I really, let's see. What exchanges do we really have? Uh, <clears throat> well, FedEx box might be assholes, but we don't care about them. But I think everyone else will do the upgrade. I mean, all they have to do is just upgrade to the new thing uh, and swap. God, this is going to be like insane. This is one of the reasons why I don't actually have too many crazy amounts of exchanges because of, because uh, like, because yeah, I'm a little worried now. How many of these pools and exchanges are going to be like, you know what, we're just going to delist your coin. You want to relist, just pay us the fee. I'm just going to be like, fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> it, it, so it's like. You know, I mean, the one person I can't say that to is actually BTC Pop, because that's the one I care about. Uh, Unnamed Exchange, I think, will be will do it. Trade Satoshi is a big maybe, because they've always been assholes. New X, I don't even know if they're still... Uh, the site still runs, but I don't think they do anything. Yeah, this is like a little-known exchange. They did it for free, so I know they'll probably do it for free. New Exchange is a little... I mean, who knows? We'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see what they decide to do uh staking pools the staking pools will do it uh or core games should be doing it too so i think we'll be good um yeah the price will be very high so yeah uh it'll be good it'll be good uh so fingers crossed right uh so anyway if you like what you saw read or heard hit the like button the follow button or subscribe button from where you're watching this from or on my uh youtubes at youtube.com forward slash gmc radio Make sure you smash that subscribe button on the right hand side of this page so we can continue uh, growing this channel. You know, it's actually nice to be doing short videos this week simply because there's just not, nothing happening. And quite frankly, behind the scenes, I'm just like so busy, right? So it's like uh, I gotta keep working on the game, which I didn't do yesterday because I was busy suffering from withdrawal from withdrawing from my video, uh, certain, uh, my mobile games, right? You know, because I, I'm, I quit. I quit Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes Cult Turkey, even though I love that game. Uh, I mean, I've gotten over Bit Heroes, so it's like, all right. Um, yeah, so, you know, I just need more, I just, I just need my, more of my time. Especially now with this swap stuff going on. So, uh, again, I'm hoping the swap process is going to be smooth. Uh, um, let's see, what, ex what, what, is, what exchanges is JMC coin on? I know it's obviously on Crex, I don't care about NewX, it's on BTC Pop, it's an unnamed. Zara's listing us for that for free, he's got North Exchange, or, oh god, it's gonna be, so it's gonna be, so basically we don't have Trade Satoshi, which is fine, because Trade Satoshi are a bunch of assholes. Okay, um, <clears throat> actually I guess before we end this, Twitter, Trade Satoshi. Actually, wait a minute. Didn't they say they were closing down? I can't remember, actually. Didn't they say they were closing down operations? Oh, yeah, here we go. Yeah, they were closing down. I wonder what happens when you go there. Oh, so I should actually remove... I should actually remove... Yeah, they're gone. I should actually remove. Uh, I should actually remove Trade Satoshi from here. Uh, yes, good. Okay. I mean, I probably already knew there were uh, problems anyway, simply because Trade Satoshi was just. Oh wait, hold on. Uh, the invoice material you'll find on page offers. Okay, I gotta actually pay. I actually have to pay this. 
Okay. Um, oh God, I, I think I'm gonna. I'm just gonna have. I'm gonna have to click the thing. Actually, I just got. I just got the reply. I gotta pay the invoice now to start the swap. Swap for. Okay. Swap four hundred four arrow four four BQC. Okay. Uh, pay. Successfully completed. Yes. Uh, how does this work? Okay. I now let me just check. I believe the money's been withdrawn. Yes. All right. We are Tomaguchi here. All right. Hold on. I got a reply. Um. Okay. Okay. Done. Let me know what the next steps are. Thanks. Okay. Uh, pay. All right. Uh, well, I don't want to. I don't want to unnecessarily prolong this. So, um, yeah. I mean, but yeah. Uh, ex probably expect some kind of update. To pretty much just go to this URL. In fact, I'll probably make sure I include this in the. Actually, it's already included in my uh, default description. Just go to the four hundred four coin Bitcoin talk thread. I'll be right here on the top. So uh, I'll see you all in tomorrow's video. Uh, get ready for the 404 coin swap. Uh, and then, yeah, we'll just have more instructions. So, you know, again, I'm hoping at least BTC pop will just do the swap for you. So all you do is just send your coins to BTC pop. They'll take care of swapping all your shit for you. And then they'll deal with cracks. And then, you know, you know, we'll have a whole system, right? And then you just, it'll just be quick, easy, and hopefully painless. Uh, preferably all three of that. So see you all tomorrow. Thanks for watching. And uh, yeah, markets just remain doing whatever they normally do. So, you know, uh, we'll see. Uh, but as long as the reopenings continue, that's all that matters. Johnson Chan, JMC coin, a 404 coin. Soon there will be more swap info. So make sure, you know, we'll uh, you know, keep track of that. Uh, and um, you know what? I think I'll just make to, since this is another thing that happened, we'll just make this the thumbnail.